Hello guys and welcome back to the channel. Once again, my name is called Sandamu and I'm here to act for you. Oi, oi, there comes my dog. Hey doggy doggy. Um, uh, hello guys, uh, thank you so much for coming here and uh, checking out this video. Today, my wonderful friends, we are going to check out the Dimash, yes. Ah, that's going to be a lot of fun. We've done two songs so far and they have been exceptional. Like seriously, I think we have one of the best <coughs> singers in the world right here. I mean, maybe he shouldn't even be on Earth. Maybe he should just fly away to a different planet where people like him maybe exist. I don't know. But he's amazing. I've enjoyed him thoroughly. And you guys seem to have enjoyed the reaction. So thank you so much, guys, for, you know, leaving comments and stuff like that. It means the world to me. It's really nice of you. Okay, um... Leave a suggestion down in the comment section below if you would like me to check something out. It will take a while though, um, so if you don't want to wait that long, my dog is still here. Hey Shopper, do you think the ball here? Nay. <laughs> Sorry about this. Um, it will take a while though, so you can become a Patreon if you don't want to wait that long, but you don't have to. I mean, I still really appreciate the support. Um, a big shout out to my missing patrons, thank you so much guys, and an even bigger shout out to my supporters in higher tiers, Brombit, Inexus, and Dimitri Exib, and this one, so we've done this one before actually, this one is called SOS, right? SOS, I think, yeah. Um, and this is from the world's best, so I've actually never seen this show before. Um, I don't really know anything about it, but I'm guessing, you know, that it's like the world's best artists and groups are here singing, you know, and competing with each other, which I think, of course, the match should be this. But this is awesome because he is in America. And I think that this is the first time he's been here, right? Because he's like from Kazakhstan and I don't know, maybe. Um, but Jesus, this is going to be fun. We've all, like I said, we've already checked out SOS. Um, so I don't really know what to expect. I'm hoping that this will be a bit different. It seems like the video is a bit shorter, so I don't know if he's um, taking out some parts or maybe it's a faster tempo or something like that. I don't know, but hopefully this will not just be the same because that would be a bit boring. I mean, guys, <laughs> like I've seen that performance like a thousand times, so absolutely love that. It's not that, it's just I want something different, you know? Some new flares to it. But let's see what he will do. Um, this one is for all you Dimash fans. This one is for you guys. Okay. <laughs> nice. I love this part, it's so soft. Really emotional as well. It sounds a little. Sounds like it doesn't have any reverb or anything. Yes, yes, my dear. So clean, it almost sounds like a flute or something. It's great. Oh, nice. Nice pullback there. Almost sounds like auditude, but it, I know it wasn't, but... Yes! Good job! Good job! Oh, damn! The mixing is very different than this. And the fire, of course. That's so cool. And the piano and everything. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, so it's a bit different. This, this part, this mixed voice there, I, that's my favorite. That's, yeah, come on, felt it, man. <laughs> he 
yeah, yeah. Dude, my dog. What a, oh, what a beast you are. What an amazing performance. He knows, he knows he pulled it up. I, 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 I don't really want to see it. It's only like it's 10 seconds left or anything like that. So that was actually a bit different. I really, mm, I don't know uh, which one I enjoyed the most, but so there are, are a couple of things that you can notice that was different um, with this performance compared to the last one. Now, at first, I thought maybe that um, he didn't use the same amount of uh, of, of pressure or um, of or force in this one because he sounded a bit lower. Um, but I think that was mostly because of the mixing. I do believe that because in this one compared to the other one, <laughs> like the first one we did, his. His voice was just so majestic, you know, that it almost you weren't able to hear the um, the orchestration in the background and the instrumentations. Which uh, I mean, that's fine. Um, it really shows how um, how great of a voice he got. But in this one, I think that he pulled his voice a bit more in the background, so you could hear more of the instrumentations. And I really enjoyed that actually because. It felt more connected, at least according to me, compared to the other one. So I didn't have an issue with that. Uh, I really think it's a, it's a mixing choice. And I guess that you can look at it both ways on what you prefer. Other than that, I think that he took away some of the parts. Um, yeah, because there were, there were some things that um, he didn't have. Which I don't think is that big of an issue. Maybe they weren't able to do the whole song or they just wanted to have a different kind of interpretation for this particular performance compared to the last one. Um, which is understandable, but I actually thought that in a lot of ways this was... I enjoyed this one more. And another thing, it didn't sound like there was anything. And this is actually quite <laughs> amazing because... From what I could hear, um, and of course I don't have the best ears, but his pitch was pretty much perfect. And so, and it didn't seem like there was anything done to his voice. And that is quite amazing when you think about, like, he goes from a baritone note all the way up to the soprano. I mean, that's just, like, if you just think about that. And he does that live. And he didn't seem to have any reverb on his voice at all. This was a lot more um, raw, I guess you, you could say. that That's a good way to, to say it. This was a lot more raw than the other version. Because you could hear that there were some special effects done to his voice, which, I mean, that is, there's nothing wrong with that. I mean, there was no audio tune from what I could hear from the last one, but they did have some reverb at least. And that, that is very common to use that, and I don't really have any issues with that. I mean, I think there's a place for that. But in this one, it didn't seem like there was any. It was just him and a piano, and then of course there were other instruments um, and orchestration that came in afterwards, but in the beginning it was... That was really cool, that was really really cool. Oh, sorry guys. Um, and I really think that if you're going to have like a competition... Um, like the world's best, then I do think that not having anything done to the voices is quite essential in my opinion you know we really want to hear how his voice sounds like of course reverb that's not a big thing but still i think that's a, a good choice to do that so i absolutely love this one maybe even more than the original <laughs> or the original i guess there's no original original but at least the one that i heard before 
But I absolutely love this. Dimash, you are killing it. You are just amazing. And I am a big fan of you. So keep on doing you, man. I absolutely appreciate it. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. I don't know why I did that. You know, click the bell icon. Give the video a thumbs up as well. And I hope I will see you soon, guys. All right? Have a good one. Bye. Qui m'attire, qui m'attire, qui m'attire,